afternoon. It's three o'clock on a Sunday. I'm gonna go ahead and meal prep all of our meals for this week for lunch and dinner. I figured I would take you through that. If you ever just have like a shopping trip where it's like such a good shopping trip and then you just purge out your entire fridge, we just did that. So our trash is now full, probably stinks. There was some stuff in there that had been sitting in the back that we forgot about. But I already went ahead and started prepping stuff. We got scallops in here and shrimp that we're gonna make. I got little snack bags of like, little cucumbers I cut up and I'm about to cut up some bell pepper now. So I'm gonna be making stuffed peppers and then chicken fajitas for tonight. So I gotta get that going. For the fajitas, we got this. We got chicken to like make it ourselves and bell peppers, but then saw this and decided to go ahead and go with that. This is the first time trying it, so I will let you know how it is, but it looks really good. And those taste good, so I'm gonna go ahead and heat this up in the skillet. So it came in a pouch like this, and it says to microwave it, but I don't wanna microwave it, so I'm just gonna break it up and let it warm up in a skillet.
I have three ounces of meat in each one of these with a tortilla. And then I will put the sides in like separate containers on the side. the piece that was connected to the shell and trash it. I've already started this, so. So this is dinner tonight. <laughs> Green bean scallops and then stuffed peppers. Yeah, so I just wanted to show you guys some examples of what we have going on for lunch this week. So we have shrimp, stuffed bell peppers, and green beans. And then the other one is that fajita mix with a tortilla. And then jalapeno and banana peppers. I have sour cream as well and a thing. Some cucumbers for a veggie. I didn't take all of these out because I don't think you need to see all of the same thing. But in this one we had leftover scallops for tonight, so I just put scallops in there. This past weekend, I got a new car. We had wanted to get the Atlas since before I even got the Tiguan, just because A, it's bigger, more room, and the fact that it could pull a boat. But I've also always wanted an F-250. So we contemplated, I got the smaller SUV and went and got a truck. Well, we don't use the truck as often as it should be driven and it's too much in diesel for me to drive it to and from work. So we would use it for taking it hunting or taking the boat when we would take the boat out. But finally decided to just sell the truck, get rid of having two vehicles for that and get the bigger SUV because this can pull the boat so bigger car more room for more babies the plan this year is probably closer to the end of the year middle closer to the end I would think we'll probably be trying for baby number two but this is my new car we haven't taken out the floor mats yet but it's literally so roomy and this one also has third row seating so I just felt like it'd be there's more room for uh you know if people ever go anywhere with us there's a lot more room we have the third row seating down right now because we just went to get groceries but that's Mackenzie's diaper bag because she loves Vampirina and then the stroller and then it's really cool because it comes with these sun protector things like built into the car they just pull up and hook in. Good morning, it's the next morning now. I am making my eggs with some of that like, green mixture. I have to get ready to leave here. I normally leave the house by 6.30. So, finishing my breakfast and I will probably take it like, on the go with me and eat it. I'm gonna go ahead and finish making my breakfast and then take that with me with some of the bacon. Um, and I have my lunch with me, so. 
today should be a good day to stay on track. All right, this is my little breakfast I got going on. And I'm gonna go ahead and make some coffee real quick. So I already have coffee in my cup there. And then I put literally two of the tiniest squirts of stevia and then some sugar-free French vanilla creamer. And typically I do about three tablespoons. So I apologize, I'm getting this video up really late. Um, but it's been a hectic past two weeks. Um, and one of the Fridays I had to work, so I didn't really have time to edit my video. And then last Friday I didn't have my camera. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this video of what we meal prepped for a week for our lunch. And I will catch you in the next video. Can you tell them bye? Bye. Bye.